All right, so hello everyone. I'm so glad you guys are able to join me. So I know we're not being, uh, we're not able to meet in person right now due to the pandemic, but I am so glad we're at least able to, you know, meet online and through Zoom to share our, you know, our holidays together. So um, I like to start off. My name is Cindy. I'm one of the social workers at Acacia. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas, everyone. And then how about we go with Anne? Can you introduce yourself and kind of just pass it down, please? Yes, this is Anne, social worker from Acacia Adult Day Services. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas to you and your family. All the best, even uh, during pandemic, but I hope all the best uh, to you and your family. How about Lou? Hey everybody, this is Lou. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas. I hope you guys are having a good time. Tanha? Hi, my name is Tanha. Um, Merry, Christ Merry Christmas to everyone and happy holiday. Um, I hope everyone's um, well and uh, during this time. Um, I know it is a very difficult time, but we could be uh, together um, to make it better. Rachel? <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least is me. Mm -hmm. uh, my name is Rachel Smythe, and I'm one of the social workers at Acacia Adult Day Services as well. Um, happy holidays and Merry Christmas to you guys. Um, yeah, we're so glad that you could be here with us on this Zoom call, and we'd like to talk a bit about um, ways that we're, we're dealing with this new holiday season for us. So I'll go back to Cindy. Thank you. So yeah, let, let's just talk about it really quick. And I think this is actually a really cool format. I think, you know, even though we're kind of far apart, but yet it kind of brings us close again and we're still able to see each other and, you know, um, talk to each other. So um, what I really like to kind of talk about is what, what are some thoughts or how you guys feel about, you know, um, holidays during the pandemic? Are there any worries or concerns or any tips that you might like to share? Um, I can go first. Um, so for me, um, I know a lot of my friends are expecting relatives and friends to come and visit overseas from overseas. And it's been like a tradition for a lot of us to be able to celebrate the holidays together. Um, I know it kind of weighs down that, you know, hey, this is really not just here in the United States, but all over the world, you know? So I think um, a way for us to kind of still be able to stay connected and still find that support is through things like this, like Zoom, FaceTime, Google, um, Hangout, anything that's possible to make this happen. And I know in Asia, we do a lot of WeChat and Line Messenger. So hopefully through that, and you can see, you know, from social media, all of the pictures and, you know, all of their uh, faces would make it kind of a little different, but still somewhere connected. Um, and then, you know, of course, I, I also really want to, you know, just tell everyone that, you know, we are also here for everyone. So if you ever feel like the need to talk to someone, you know, you can always reach out to us, the social workers, and also to your friends and family. And, you know, for sure, we're here for you. Okay. And then, um, Lou, how about for you? I know the holidays can be a very festive time for many people. And this year, it might be a little bit different with the pandemic going on. Um, you know, but a lot of people have memories of spending Christmas, New Year, Thanksgiving with their family mm -hmm. and loved ones. Mm -hmm. um, but it's also important to note that, you know, a lot of people, it, it, it could be a sad time for them as well, too. Um, if they've lost a loved one, you know, a family member or a friend, um, the holidays sometimes can be a reminder of that they're not there anymore, mm -hmm. the uh, reminders of, you know, holidays that they spent with them uh, in the past. And it's important to just try to focus on, you know, the positive memories you have, the friends, the family that you have living still, um, the positive memories that you may have made with the, the person in the past that is no longer with you. Um, it's, yeah, it's important to focus on that and not so much on, you know, the negative aspects of it. Thank you, Lou. Um, how about for you, Rachel? You know, I, I really like what Lou said about um, acknowledging that the holidays 
are a really happy time for a lot of people that some people, this is the part of the year they look forward to the most. Um, but that for other people, you know, it really is a time that can be painful and um, bring up a lot of hard um, things to deal with and, and sad memories and thinking about the people we've lost and um, not really being able to do those things um, that we consider traditions, at least this year, uh, because of the pandemic. Um, so for me, you know, I think it's really good to be able to set realistic expectations for ourselves, um, to know that we're doing our best and mm -hmm. um, to really also acknowledge your feelings that just because it is the holidays and, you know, it's a time for, again, for so many that it's very joyous, that it's okay if you're feeling kind of sad that you're, you're missing somebody that you love. Um, what really does seem to help when you're going through a hard time is expressing your feelings. You know, it's okay if you need to take a break or cry, just whatever it is to help you get it out, um, I think is really important. And part of that means um, reaching out to somebody that you care about and trust. So if you're having a hard time over the holidays, um, maybe you can call a friend or you can call um, a family member and just talk to them about it and see if they might be feeling the same way too. Um, and then I also hope that through all of that, that we can all find something that we do do feel joyous about um, mm -hmm. during the holidays, whether it be that we still get to see our family, um, even if it's on Zoom or, you know, to appreciate um, some beautiful Christmas lights or watch a, um, a fun movie on TV, just something that does kind of lift your spirits. Um, I hope you get to do something like that as well. Uh, but we're here for you. And um, yeah, just us not being so hard on ourselves, I think will really help us get through um, this holiday season. And I thank you guys for being those people for me that I can share with and express how I'm feeling. So thank you guys. And um, maybe Tanha, you could share a little bit with us about, about what you're thinking this holiday season. Yeah, um, so I really like uh, uh, Rachel and Lou's um, talk about earlier. Um, but you know, to me, I feel that uh, from what we doing right now through Zoom, even though that we can be together in person, but at least that through the video that we can see each other. Um, so it could be the same thing with uh, you, um, that you can call your family, you can do FaceTime with your family members uh, who uh, not live in the same house with you, um, that at least you can see their face, that you see that they still healthy. Um, <laughs> I know the holiday is very difficult for everyone and to, uh, it's happened in my family as well. Um, my, my mom is really sad over the Thanksgiving that my siblings not able to come in over due to the, um, the pandemic. So, um, but I support her by telling her moms, uh, unless you still know that they're healthy, um, you can talk to them through FaceTime. You have your iPhone now, you can call them, FaceTime them, and uh, you still see them. So um, I convinced her and she did that. She feels much better. And I said, you know, we always hope for the best. Um, use whatever that accessible that could connect with your family member or your loved ones, even though that uh, uh, they're not right next to you. Um, it's hard for, uh, for, uh, for, uh, for you uh, or your family not there, but I share that with uh, a lot of my participants. They said, well, yeah, uh, my children, they uh, set time that they're going to call in together in the Zoom so then everyone can see uh, all the family members. So that's how mm -hmm. they're going to plan to celebrate uh, this coming Christmas because they, I, I know it's hard for everyone, uh, for us, um, also that to um, accept this uh, situation that going on um, during this time right now, but I, I always uh, uh, think positive that things will get better, and it's most important thing that how that we um, lift up our spirit by thinking um, positive and stay active, and connect with your friends, connect with your family members, um, and. Uh, 
continue doing your hobbies and what you like to do. Um, so to make your day, um, daily life that more uh, meaningful. So then um, with the hope for the best that we gonna be together again. So I always hope that this holiday gonna bring you uh, peace and uh, find joints for yourself and uh, create something that very positive that bring you um, to uh, the happiness that you could find uh, during this difficult time. So um, how about you, Anne? Yes, uh, holidays, you know, coming and the holiday season is a very, very important, um, especially for during this difficult time, very challenging for all of us, uh, not being able to get together uh, like a usual, you know, party or celebrating for the holidays. So this time is very different. And so I hope uh, we been able to adapt with the situation and you know during this time especially please take care of yourself very well doing self-care management do things for yourself in order for you to be able to take care of the others that's a very important thing during the pandemic so and we all have learning that we need to take care of ourselves first in order for us to be able to take care of the others. So during holidays, even harder. So please take care of yourself, doing things that you like for yourself, take care of yourself, doing something positive. And when you're doing th something positive and you also help those around you being positive as well. So that's the way that we try to celebrate the holidays. So I hope the best you can. And you know, with the, now if you cannot do things like uh, before, now we can do thanks to the high tech. So we can have virtual uh, celebration, virtual meeting with your family, with your friends, reach out to all those you, you want to reach out. So I hope the best, the best for the holiday. Thank you, Anne. That those are all really great ideas and suggestions. Um, I really liked, you know, what Tom Hart and Anne said about, you know, doing the self care and be more aware of, you know, things that you can do for yourself. Um, so again, you know, Anne, Tom Hart, Rachel, all of us all listed something that you might be able to do to, you know, celebrate uh, either virtually or by yourself or whatever it may be. But if you need ideas, go ahead and reach out to us. We have a, a lot of uh, ideas and resources. We also have other staff from other departments that have wonderful ideas too. Um, so um, I'd like to kind of just have Lou kind of share maybe something short um, in Spanish for um, mm -hmm. our participants and then same with Tong Han and Anne and I will also do that. Um, maybe I'll do that right now with um, the Mandarin. And then um, again, you know, afterwards, you know, I would like for you guys to just kind of share something short and sweet, okay? So, um, 大家好, 我知道现在我们没有办法当年一起庆祝圣诞节 呃，很想做些什么事情，或是想要找你的亲戚朋友的时候啊，那就记得给他们打个电话，或者是可以打个电话给我，我来帮你们呃想办法一起做一些呃圣诞节可以做的事情。那我也希望大家知道，就是你不
y amigos que han perdido en el pasado, pero es importante para enfocar en las cosas positivas que tenemos en la vida todavía y las memorias también de, de los tiempos bonitos que tuvimos. So, es muy importante este Navidad tomar un poquito de tiempo para vos mismo, hacer algo que te gusta hacer, cuidar a vos mismo, um, you know, mirar una película que te gusta o mirar las luces de las casas de, de Navidad, cualquier cosa que trae un poquito de alegría a tu vida y pasar tiempo con, con familia. Um, no van a poder pasar el mismo tiempo con la familia por la pandemia, pero hay muchas formas de conectar con la familia, llamándolos por teléfono, haciendo llamadas de video, por FaceTime, por Zoom. So, la tecnología que tenemos ahorita se puede hacer muchas cosas y todavía podemos seguir conectados. Y siempre tienen a nosotros, los trabajadores sociales de Acacia, para, para llamar, para platicar y para ver cómo están todos. So, es importante para seguir conectados con todos y estar contento este, este año y que el próximo año sea un muy, muy pro, próspero año para, para todos. Anne. Chào các bác, các cô, các chú. Um, cháu uh, xin uh, kính chúc các bác, các cô, các chú và toàn thể gia quyến uh, một mùa lễ um, an lành sức khỏe và luôn luôn uh, cố gắng duy trì uh, sức khỏe đặc biệt trong cái thời gian uh, dịch bệnh này cháu biết năm nay rất là khó khăn trong cái thời gian này uh, mùa lễ sắp đến thì có nhiều cái nó khác như các năm trước cho nên uh, cái việc mừng lễ đối với gia đình không có được bình thường như mọi năm uh, và có um, may bây giờ mình cũng có những cái phương tiện cao cấp hơn cho nên cũng có những cái Zoom, những cái FaceTime như vậy thì chắc cũng giúp cho các bác, các cô, các chú gặp được người thân của mình uh, trong những cái ngày lễ như ví, ví dụ lễ tạ ơn vừa qua không có được đến gần để mừng lễ với nhau thì cũng được gặp qua các cái hình ảnh đó. Cháu hy vọng là các bác, các cô, các chú và toàn thể gia quyến cũng từ từ làm quen với những cái uh, khó khăn trong cái mùa dịch bệnh và có thể mừng cái mùa lễ này một cách uh, mặc dù khó khăn nhưng mà vẫn có ý nghĩa và vẫn có những cái niềm vui à, và cháu cũng à, khuyên các bác các cô các chú và gia đình có những cái khó khăn trong cái mùa lễ mình sẽ có những cái mà mình không được như ý mình đó thì xin các bác các cô các chú cũng cố gắng à, chịu khó à, là làm những cái gì có thể ví dụ như mình cố gắng chăm sóc sức khỏe cho mình à, về phần thể lý không những phần phần thể lý mà còn về bệnh tinh thần Uh, vui vẻ thoải mái để mình có thể uh, có thể duy trì được trong cái thời gian này để chờ đợi uh, trong cái năm mới 2200 2021 sắp tới tốt hơn uh, để mình có thể uh, trở lại những cái sinh hoạt bình thường nhưng mà trong cái thời gian này thì xin các bác các cô các chú cố gắng duy trì sức khỏe tinh thần uh, và giúp cho cái um, giúp cho cái gia đình của mình trong những cái ngày lễ này được có ý nghĩa mặc dù nó hơi khó khăn cháu kính chúc các bác các cô các chú một mùa lễ vui hạnh phúc và bình an mặc dù trong những cái khó khăn đang gặp phải và thanh hà cũng sẽ nói chuyện với các bác các cô các chú một chút xíu à, cháu kính chào các bác các cô các chú chào các bác và gia đình à, mùa giáng sinh này cháu kính chúc các bác và gia đình luôn luôn có sức khỏe dồi dào bình an và tìm được sự à, à, hạnh phúc từ trong à, tâm hồn cũng như trong gia đình à, cái mùa giáng sinh và mùa lễ này à, cháu biết là rất là khó khăn cho tất cả mọi người à, nhưng mà cháu lúc nào cũng hy vọng à, các bác và gia đình à, mình có thể à, liên lạc với gia đình của mình nếu mà mình không gặp được nhau uh, như những năm trước thì mình có thể uh, gọi nhau qua FaceTime hoặc là Zoom hoặc là những cái phương tiện video để mà mình có thể uh, nhìn được thấy nhau uh, biết nhau, biết là người thân của mình vẫn còn khỏe mạnh, uh, bình an uh, thì cháu hy vọng là các bác uh, có luôn có tinh thần tốt giữ vững tinh thần uh, tốt và khỏe mạnh và luôn um, làm những điều gì mà mình uh, cảm thấy tốt cho sức khỏe của mình um, và lúc nào mình cũng um, hăng say uh, tập thể dục 
à, và giữ vững cái tinh thần tốt để à, sang năm mới mình có một cái à, 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 niềm tin và sức khỏe tốt hơn để mà hy vọng à, mình có thể gặp lại nhau à, như à, từ trước đến giờ thì cháu à, hy vọng à, mùa Giáng sinh này mang lại cho các bác và gia đình à, sự bình an à, trong tâm hồn và sức khỏe dồi dào. Cảm ơn các bác và gia đình. Oh, thank you so much. So, um, basically, that concludes our meeting today. Um, again, you know, I like to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Uh, we will see each other soon. I believe so. And uh, be safe. And if anybody else wants to kind of just say, you know, before we end, if you want to add in anything. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Oh, sorry. Merry, Christmas. Happy <laughs> Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Stay healthy. All right. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody. Bye.